Hi guys, I've got the beautiful Shialda station behind me and today I'm going somewhere beautiful. The place where I'm going to today is also known as the city of love. I'm going to Kalyani. It is widely believed that Dr. Vidhan Chandra Roy fell in love with Kalyani, the daughter of the famous doctor, Dr. Nilratan Sarkar. The young man mustered courage to visit Dr. Sarkar, the most famous and rich doctor of Calcutta at that time, to seek the hands of Kalyani, one of his five daughters. Dr. Sarkar rejected the proposal and insulted the young doctor by saying that his daughter's daily makeup costs thrice the young doctor's monthly salary. Dr. Roy felt dejected. He was so hurt by this rejection that he vowed to remain single for the rest of his life. Through utter perseverance and sheer hard work, Dr. Roy went on to become the chief minister of the state of West Bengal and built an engineering marvel of a city known as the city of Kalyani. Kalyani. Uh, I was at the station and we shot there for a bit and now we are touring the city of Kalyani. It's got really beautiful roads, really nice architecture and it's, just, it's super well planned. You can make out from just by looking at the city. Now coming to the administrative aspect of why he decided to build a satellite city to Kolkata we must analyze two factors. Firstly, after independence, West Bengal witnessed a large influx of refugees from East Pakistan, today also known as Bangladesh. As Chief Minister, Dr. Roy felt that the need of the hour was to build satellite townships around Kolkata to accommodate urban development and industrial growth. Kalyani was one such township he had envisioned. Secondly, the 59th Indian National Congress meeting was scheduled to be held in 1954. Therefore, the construction of the amenities of the city was completed in a record time of three years. In memoirs of the conference, a road of the city was named as a Congress Road. The name of the current Kalyani railway station was changed from Chandmari Halt to Kalyani. In 1957, the Kalyani police station was formed and in 1979, the rail line was extended from Kalyani Main to Kalyani Simanta Station. And this established direct connectivity from Kolkata through the Kalyani Simanta local EMU trains. In conclusion, the unfulfilled love of West Bengal's second chief minister found its final sculpting in the form of a beautiful city, which was built with the intention of urbanizing the state and with the agility of being completed in record time. The triumph of Dr. Roy's story lies not only in naming of the city after his lost love, but also in the city itself, which was meticulously crafted and can compete with any modern Indian smart city. In fact, without much alterations, the city of Kalyani was declared as a smart city in 2014, when the concept of smart cities started to become prevalent in the rest of India.